The universe is full of interesting objects like planets, comets, asteroids, stars, which are 2,000 times the size of the sun, and supermassive black holes that may rip celestial bodies apart. It can be easier to consider the nature of close objects like planets. So although our solar system has many huge planets, we may be staring at the largest planet in the universe. How big is this planet? Where is it? How would it be compared to nearby planets? Join us in this video as we show you the largest planet ever found. Even if the answer seems obvious, we need a definition to identify celestial bodies. Planet is defined clearly. They'll say a star's accretion disk forms a planet, but it doesn't help us to bait the definition. Thankfully, a regulatory agency can help us. The International Astronomical Union describes a planet as having three traits or performing three tasks. It must orbit a star, be large enough to be molded spherically by gravity, and have a large enough orbit around its star to pass through. This definition sparked debate because Pluto wasn't included. It's handy because it excludes several heavenly bodies. Also consider exoplanet. Exoplanets are planets outside our solar system. This leads to a Jupiter-like exoplanet. Scientists discovered this nine times massive planet. They characterized it as still in the womb. This discovery puts doubt on common understanding about planets, since a gas giant circling far from its young host star was identified and investigated using the Hubble Space Telescope in orbit, as well as the Subaru Telescope near a dormant Hawaiian volcano. Jupiter and Sechen are gas giants. These planets are mostly hydrogen and helium, with only a small solid core. This research may help find extraterrestrial life. Thane Curry of the Subaru Telescope and NASA Ames Research Center think it's still young. This is the first evidence of gas giant formation. It's surrounded by a large disk of gas and dust that contains planet-forming ingredients. Hurricane, which is 508 light years or 9.5 trillion kilometers from exoplanets, has been found 5,000 times. One of the largest is a B or B. It's near the maximum size that is required to be classified as a planet instead of a brown dwarf, a body midway between a planet as well as a star. Gas and dust heat it. Nearly all exoplanets orbit nearer to their stars than our Sun and Neptune. This planet revolves around the Sun at 93 times Earth's distance and three times that of Neptune's. Its formation deviates from the standard planetary formation hypothesis. According to Olivier Dion, a researcher, if not all planets produced by the gradual accumulation of solids onto one rocky core, and also the gas giant undergo this phase, well before solid core, is large enough just to begin accreting gas. In this scenario, protoplanets in a young star's disk transition from dust to boulders. When their cores reach Earth's mass, they start gathering disk gas. This discovery defies planet formation theory. Guan claimed this technique can't create a massive planet far from Earth. Scientists assume a B or B forms when the star's disk cools and gravity drives it to split up into clumps that become planets. According to Curry, there are different ways to cook an egg, and there could be more than one way for Jupiter to form. The star AB Origa is 60 times brighter and 2.4 times more massive than our Sun, which is 4.5 billion years old. Our understanding of the cosmos is improved by the ongoing challenge of new astronomical evidence to our hypotheses. So, what's rocks 42 Beeb's diameter? The biggest planet in the cosmos may be 2.5 times larger than Jupiter. This huge planet was found in 2013 in the Yuki Cloud Cluster. This planet is also known as Hot Jupiter. Jupiter is 400 million kilometers from the Sun. Rocks 42 BB has a short orbital period around its star. Due to the velocity of their host star's orbits, the terminology which used to identify it indicates that its surface temperature seems exceedingly high. Jupiter is easier to measure. Scientific consensus says Rocks 42 BB is a planet, unlike previous candidates. 
Some candidates for the universe's biggest planet aren't even planets. HG 100546b is a 6.9 RJ is a planet. The exoplanet's mass and other properties suggest it's a brown dwarf, an object between a planet and its stars. Despite being larger than planets, these stars didn't have enough mass to fuse hydrogen. Defunct brown dwarfs grow rapidly for much of their life. Brown dwarfs are among the biggest planets, yet they are not planets. A super Jupiter around two stars defies predictions about planet formation and environment. B Centauri is 325 light years away away from the gas giant, which is 11 times bigger than Jupiter, but looks to have a similar composition. It is one of a category of planets called Super Jupiters, which have masses bigger than the greatest planets in the solar system. Its orbit is 560 times greater than Earth's and 100 times broader than Jupiter's. It spins around with a binary system, a combination of gravitationally coupled stars. B Centauri's two stars have 6 to 10 times the Sun's mass. No planet with three times the Sun's mass has ever been found. Larger stars were formerly thought to end planet formation. Radiation emissions disprove the idea. I will explain how it happened. Marcus Johnson and his colleagues used the Sphere Exoplanet Imaging System, a big telescope in Paranal Chile, to study the star system. Marcus went into it with a blank brain, thinking there might be no planets surrounding the stars, which would have been intriguing. More interesting would be if there were planets orbiting them. Early in the survey, around March 2019 and April 2021, scientists discovered a planet with unusual properties. B Centauri, A, and B Centauri, B make the B Centauri system, and their combined mass is 6 to 10 times that of the Sun, making them too massive for a big planet. Both are hotter than usual planet-hosting stars. The newly found planet resides in B Centauri's bigger tandem star. This star is three times hotter and five to six times the Sun's mass. It emits UV and X-rays. B-type stars are brilliant blue stars, only 15 million years old in cosmic perspective. Compared to the Sun, a little is learned about the tiny planet. Its mass is one-tenth to four times that of Sun at same distance as Earth from the Sun. Closely orbiting stars. Scientists thought that stars with masses higher than three times the Sun could support planets because they would provide an unfavorable planetary formation environment. This discovery affects our view of planetary formation. Strangeness abounds. Its past isn't unusual. The planet's circular orbit meant a tranquil upbringing. Most planets possess elliptical orbital periods around their star, possibly due to early impacts from asteroids and other space debris. Scientists believe this one had a tranquil history, so it may have developed nearby. Planets arise from leftover gas and dust from star formation. These particles collide and become larger until a planet forms. Planet discovery questions the creation timetable. The planets form in the immense disks with swirling gas and dust which surround young stars and combines to form planets. High intensity radiation from such huge stars threatens the development of a giant planet. Before this finding, Astronomers thought these stars couldn't generate gas giant planets. They have nothing to form it with. Therefore, they wouldn't have enough time before the disk disappeared. This discovery could speed up planet formation. The crew will observe it further. They've bid on some of the largest telescopes to study the planet's surface and some other aspects. Jupiter is still the largest planet in the solar system. This gas giant planet has a 43,000 441 mile radius and 317 times Earth's mass. However, it's not a brown dwarf. The planet's mass is insufficient. Most brown dwarfs are twice as huge as Earth. Jupiter is a gas giant. Recent findings of cannibalized baby planets and Jupiter's cloudy belly have ended a long-running debate about the gas giant's formation. NASA's Juno space probe's gravitational data 
allowed scientists to glimpse through Jupiter's clouds. With this knowledge, the researchers mapped out the rocky constitution of the planet's core and showed a surprising amount of heavy metals. Jupiter's chemical makeup reveals that it consumed planetesimals to power its expansion. Jupiter formed by accumulating rocky material like every other planet. Even though now it's mostly gas, as gravity drew in additional rocks, the planet's rocky core began gathering hydrogen and helium left over from the sun's birth to produce its vast atmosphere. Two theories explain how Jupiter first gathered rocky material. According to one idea, Jupiter accumulated billions of pebble-sized space rocks, which are actually boulders. According to the new study, Jupiter's core was generated by the absorption of planetesimals, or massive space pebbles, the diameter of several miles, that, if left undisturbed, may have acted as seeds for the construction of smaller rocky planets, like the Earth or Mars. It's unclear which one of these hypotheses is correct. Since scientists can't directly view Jupiter's origin, they must put together the mystery using existing data. To address the controversy, researchers had to develop a model of Jupiter's interior. Seismographs enable us to examine Earth's interior via earthquakes. The designation of the largest planet ever discovered depends on how exoplanets were defined, according to the researchers. Future discoveries may change how we view these planets. Planetology is complex. International groups dispute on how to classify planets, dwarf planets, and exoplanets. Jupiter is the solar system's largest planet. That's reality. Our global understanding will develop over time. Researchers produce new discoveries all the time. They may make a finding that deconstructs everything we know. Let me know down in the comments what thoughts are going inside your mind after watching the video. Also, if you enjoyed watching this, please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to be the first to watch our newly uploaded video. Thanks for watching guys, do check out these videos to get your mind blown.